welcome back to my channel i am back and my little pickle is back he wants to say hi say hi everybody how are you all doing we hope you are all well well you want to see your mommy's lap so you stay there yes welcome back to my channel and if you're new here hello it's lovely to meet you if you haven't already remember to subscribe to my channel for more contents just like this and also remember to click that bell icon so you get notified every time I have a new video. And of course, give this video a like if this is the sort of thing that you enjoy watching. Today we are off to Primark, finally! First up, we walk past these reduced sections and there seem to be quite a few rows of them. And then I spotted all these lovely dresses. I like this khaki one. And this is the sort of dress that I always wear back when I was a little bit younger, put it that way. But yeah, I used to love these sort of dresses. I don't know about it now, but I must say I was a little bit all over the place. I didn't really know what I wanted if I was going to actually buy any clothes or if I was just going to film. But one thing for sure, I wanted to film and... I was trying to test the water because, frankly, the weather is so confusing the hell out of me that I don't even fancy wearing any summer clothes just yet because it's still pretty nippy. So we went in there and not really knowing what I wanted, what I fancy buying. I was a little bit all over the place and I'm really well confused, to be perfectly honest. Having said that, a lot of the clothes, it screams summer in there and it was lovely to see. But I wasn't in the mood just yet to buy any summer clothes, if you know what I mean. I wasn't ready to give up my jumper just yet. Somehow this is making me feel that actually perhaps I needed to do some shopping for my summer clothes. All this floral dress are actually making me feel like perhaps I do need one. This fabric's like one of those jersey fabric. I think it is called jersey fabric. It's nice, it's soft, it's light. Also, one thing I've noticed and I like about Primark, all these clothes are made using recycled materials. So I like that about them. And then I spotted the skirts and the husband is like, oh no, 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 no. They look like my mom's old skirts. But you know what? I do like them, especially this dark floral one and these pleated ones i don't know why but i feel like it feels quite elegant and i am considering getting one myself and then i spotted some trousers like work trousers these are perfect for work if you do a nine to five job or even a casual wear i think this is perfect just to go out if you are not a big fan of jeans at one point i was not keen on wearing jeans because I find it too tight so I was more into like casual trousers such as this and I think these are fashionable and comfortable as well the fabric feels nice and comfortable except for this one the fabric was a little bit rough and this is the handbag that I have been telling my husband since December and there is a funny story about this and I will tell you on the whole later on in the video then we walk past all these denims and some skirts and jackets i particularly like this one this one is perfect for a cooler weather like this it's not cold it's just a little bit cool um it's perfect for this temperature and also autumn Oh, bless him. He's trying his best to find clothes for me. Oh, bless him. He thought this will look good on me. I'm like, no, thank you, darling, but no. <laughs> Every single time I try jeans like this, he laughs at me. It might be a myth, but... The funny thing about it, that works for me. So if I try it this way, I know for a fact that it's going to fit me. So please comment down below if you do this as well. 
So I've always done it that way and it always works for me. But the husband said it doesn't work for him. It never has. I've noticed that most of them, especially on these aisles, are like super high waist. I can't believe this is size 8. And I mean, I am size 8 to size 10, depending on how generous the size is. But this is far too tiny for size 8. It feels like it is size 4 or something. See if that one fit me. <laughs> is a selection of ripped jeans it's extreme ripped skinny high waist to be exact and then we also come across these vintage mom jeans i don't think i can pull this off well i'm only barely five feet so i feel if i wear this this is going to swallow me whole <laughs> I must say Primark has got some gorgeous Disney characters clothing line and it really is summer in here. Look at all the selections of pajama sets and you can tell they are summer pajamas because the fabrics are fairly thin. There are some, some long sleeve pajama set and some short sleeve pajama sets as well. I love my pajamas. I really do, especially in the winter. Come summer, I think because it's pretty warm, long sleeve pajamas and trousers are actually a no-no for me in the summer. The shorts pajama sets though, yes, definitely. There are some gorgeous selection of colors, of designs. one of my favorite this stars tea and short set and of course the disney character socks gorgeous absolutely gorgeous some more pajama sets i am gonna walk you through all these guys and you're gonna see a lot i am trying not to cut so much because i feel that for you especially that haven't had a chance to venture out just yet at least you will have an idea of what is in store in Primark so I will definitely try not to cut this one so you might actually see these videos in two parts one today and the other one would be tomorrow because it's such a shame to cut it otherwise you won't be able to see what I've actually seen in fact this video is just really a fraction of what is in store so this is just a very selected clips actually and yet it's still very long so definitely a part to tomorrow coming your way including the haul i love night t-shirts in the summer so this is definitely the aisle for me including the short shorts i am quite impressed with primark definitely a lot of their materials are made using sustainable cottons and also made from recycled materials it's just fantastic these are the short shorts that I absolutely love in the summer. I feel though, you definitely need to only wear this indoors because they are skimpy and they are thin. In fact, some of them looks like, <laughs> my husband said some of them, they look like my mum's old curtains. <laughs> An old pillowcase. Yeah, it looks more like an old pair of curtains. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is a better fabric. I am just showing you some of this, really. There's still plenty that I haven't even opened. This is my favorite of them. The fabric is the softest. It's really nice and light. And the color is black, so it's definitely a yes for me. And these are the crop tops that goes with it. <laughs> crop tops what are they called yeah they are crop tops aren't they i am not really very good with materials and i don't know what they all called so if you do please do let me know in the comment section below i am here also to learn from you guys and i would very much appreciate it
have this firm control reversible tummy i think please don't quote me on this you can agree or disagree with me but i think we all need this one after a very long lockdown <laughs> i myself feel like getting this tan one i feel somehow the shape have changed since the lockdown but i just feel like this one can make or break for me if i wear this it's either it will show the curve and i will look good in it or it's going to show my body really straight or perhaps the rolls i'm not quite sure but i think it's a good idea i for one definitely feel like i needed them after long months of lockdown i feel like i'm ready for it <laughs> i like the fact that if you're wearing this one there is actually just buttons underneath so you can just undo that one if you need to go to the loo and you don't have to take the whole thing off <laughs> which is one thing that i dislike about one piece like this but this one is i think perfect and also it's invisible at the back because it's nice and lace it's, it looks really delicate it's absolutely gorgeous i just love particularly this beige one but definitely if i need it i am going to get one myself i just love this handbag this sort of materials are usually made from where I come from. Every time I go home in Philippines, somehow I always come back with a handbag similar to this material. And this is perfect for the summer. My husband said it looks like the basket that I bought in the past. <laughs> and I said, well, it's the same material. This one is a cross body bag, and almost the same size as my Michael Kors one that I'm wearing right now. <laughs> This dress looks absolutely gorgeous in the mannequin, but on its own, in a hanger, it doesn't look anything special at all. It's absolutely gorgeous in a mannequin, and um, the only thing is the material is not a soft material. It's a little bit quite, it's, although it's thin, but it feels a little bit rough for some reason. handbags just never-ending handbags this style has got black beige and green i'm telling my husband that this sort of handbag back in the 90s i had one of these in different color and different print that my aunties from germany gave me and i felt like the fashionable one in school because i was the only one wearing it back then i love this material look at this this is gorgeous please if you know this material do let me know in the comment section down below this is absolutely beautiful and my husband called this the adult baby grow <laughs> there's three different colors here there's black this blush Pink. And the other one at the back, I believe, is a burgundy. This one is a lace. And the other half is made from a very soft velvet material. This one is a sleeveless one but with color and um, it looks really sexy but I'm not a fan of leopard prints. These lacy short sleeves as well looks absolutely stunning. And then I came across all these shorts. They are gorgeous. Absolutely screaming summer and it looks like it is quite flattering actually to wear just the hat i was looking for actually last summer and um yeah oh this bag is very much similar to the material that i've seen earlier i don't really know what 
that material is called but this one is a hexagon shape swimsuits different colors and i came across this i like this one what do you call this Asa this is not a sari what do you call this one this is just this is the sort of stuff that you wear on top of your swimsuit and my husband said to me if you wear that in the garden i won't be able to see you because you'll blend in with the flowers <laughs> i love them and this one what do you call this one you know one thing that the only thing in primark is the products are not very well labeled so you can't really see the description of the clothes but i love this one um i know for a fact that you also wear this on top of swimsuits by the beach and my husband has been telling me that you wear this when you go to glastonbury i'm like no you wear this by the beach <laughs> We were having a bit of an argument in the store because I insist, no, you wear this in the beach. And he's like, oh, no, you wear that in Glastonbury. I'm like, what are you talking about? <laughs> anyway, guys, I'm going to have to leave you for now. And please do come back tomorrow because I have got so much more to show you tomorrow, including my haul at the end of tomorrow's video. So you don't want to miss that one. I hope to see you then for now. Thank you for watching and see you tomorrow on part two.